Hello Jurassic fans, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to take a look at the four blues Mattel released and we're going to pick the best one. First we have the attack pack released in 2018 and was the first blue figure released. The paint job is a little so-so, just a blue stripe smashed on it. There is no action feature. And you can articulate this here, the arms, the legs, the mouth. But it's a cheap figure and there's nothing much special about this one. The other 2018 figure was the Story Pack Blue. This one had painted nails but very very large feet because of its action feature and the action feature you had to push it down so it could jump you could move the head left to right that's very good the head is sculpted differently as well it has more detail and you have this the bumps on its head it has more the it looks more like a raptor otherwise just the arms move to turn the head open the beak and the jump action feature this is the 2018 battle damage version you can see the blue stripe is much more detailed it's very nice with the white paint around it its action feature was the battle damage where you could open and close the wound very playable the head could turn slightly open its beak or moving of the arms moving of the legs but overall this sculpt looked the best of the 2018 figures this is the 2019 savage strike blue the blue stripe is more detailed, it's the, the white paint around the blue stripe. Its accent feature was the slashing arms, here, you could move its legs, but mine are a little bit loose, so that's also something Mattel figures have from time to time. Could turn its head completely. Very nice. The beak, arms, legs, yeah. That's much like the like the other figures. So what is my favorite figure? When I look at the attack pack, the blue stripe ain't done that well when you compare it to the other ones. And also it has no action features, so this one ain't my favorite. Next one is the Story Pack. Story Pack Raptor, the one who's repackaged the most. Uh, the big feet are really off putting. I like the head, but also the blue stripe ain't that detailed like the other two. If your kid wants a blue, I recommend the Dino Rivals version. If you are a collector and you like to put your dinosaurs on shelves or take pictures with them for some toy photography, I recommend the Battle Damage one. But my pick would be the Dino Rivals version. Do you agree with what I picked? Let me know in the comments down below. Also, if you like this video, please subscribe and I'll see you next time. Bye.